Hey everyone, my name is Lynn Wilson and I am glad you're here today. Thanks for coming to my home. Thanks for inviting me in your home. And we're gonna have some fun. I'm addicted. I am confessing in front of the entire world. I have an addiction, it's called Dollar Tree. I love it, I just get tingly when I see a Dollar Tree sign and I get tingly when I talk about Dollar Tree and I get excited and I, I don't know, it's just a crazy thing. But listen, if that's the biggest thing in my life that I have that I can call an addiction, I'm doing okay. Now, they say don't feed your addiction. We have a problem about maybe half a mile from my house. I could probably walk to it if I wanted to or needed to. They are building a Dollar Tree store and it's not the kind that's like in a strip mall it's the kind that stands alone and they're usually bigger bolder and better so guess which girl is going to be online to go on the first day when they open ah yeah me. i again am glad you're here um if this is going to be if you're not into a longer video just turn this off if you're not into dollar tree and me being goofy and having fun just turn this off you want to sit back and just see what I got and you and I have a conversation and you feel like you're sitting in my home in my living room right now and you and I are going to talk then hang on because that's what we're going to do so today I'm just being Lynn so here we are in my living room no frills hairs up day off jean jacket I love denim I live in denim so I'm going to just show you what I got and again it might be a little bit of a longer video and if you don't like that you can Come back another video if you like it hang in there with me i like seeing what people get at dollar tree i get all excited what do you guys have at your dollar tree dollar tree that i don't have and what i have to look for for the next time ask it so my niece is having a birthday in november and we don't do big gifts for the kids anymore we kind of you know scale down but i wanted to do her a little you know teen kind of spa gift basket with eyelashes you know, I'm into the eyelash thing. So, and if you don't know what I'm talking about, go check out my gift basket. But, just got her a few things. Dollar Tree, of course. So, VO5 Passion Fruit Smoothie Shampoo. One dollar. And then I picked up a um, shaving gel. Personal care. Moisturizing with vitamin A. I actually picked up one for myself, but I don't know where. I think it may be filling in the car because I picked up two of these and I can't find the other one. So, a shaving gel for her. And then I picked her up, a, um, I tried to get as much pink as you can see, um, in, you know, to try and keep it in the same color, uh, cleansing cloths. So just, you know, taking off makeup, wiping your face in the morning, that kind of thing. And you know, teen girl's skin is always kind of like a big deal. So this one is called Treat Me Bath Burst, and it is a rainbow, like a bath bomb, I guess. I then I picked this up, a gel mask and scrub polishing charcoal and black sugar. Never heard of black sugar, but that's what it says. Two pack special. This side was the pink, so I probably will put that side, you know, as I line everything up. Um, and it's a nail grooming kit, as you can see there. And it has um, one, two, three, one, two, three four of the nail files that look like a butterfly and then you have a big one in the middle that has polka dots and of course had to be pink. I don't even know if she likes pink but she's getting pink. And then it has a cuticle uh, tool there and a, a nail clip there. Now this is not, you know, this is not like going to Macy's and getting a real fancy smanchy one from Clinique or something. This is Dollar Tree but this is perfect for just that quick little, you know, put in your purse and you need to do a nail file. So those things I picked up for her and that will be for her little spa gift basket. And when I put it together, I will show you guys how I decorate her gift basket so you have a second idea of what you can do. Okay, a couple other things I picked up. Uh, my son loves these shells and cheese, macaroni and cheese, a poultry seasoning. I didn't even know they sold that. I've seen other spices, but I didn't see the poultry seasoning. I picked up a pumpkin pie spice seasoning. I've never seen that at Dollar Tree. And I don't know how good it is, but we're going to try it out. Then I picked these up. My son is enjoying these. This is something new to him. Sun-kissed orange singles on the go. You get six. These are those little um, packets you can put in your water bottles. So I picked up the sun-kissed orange. 
crush watermelon for him. Six in there. Canada Dry Cranberry Ginger Ale. I don't know. Picked up an air freshener for the bathroom. Baby Fresh scent. I sprayed it earlier. You can actually smell it right in there. It's really nice. It was in the baby department, so if you're looking for one. I picked up an ibuprofen, which would be comparable to Advil. 30 tablets for a dollar. What else did we get? I par purchased the Travel Wipes Antibacterial. 30 total wipes. It's two travel packs. So let me show you that first. All right, and then I actually thought they used to sell, you can see real tiny on here, they used to sell the individual packets, like you would get one wipe, like if you go to a restaurant and they give you a wipe to, you had ribs, you get the one wipe in the bag. They used to sell a box of the individual wipes, and I liked that, I would keep them in my wallet. And that's what I thought these were. Turned out I was wrong, but that's okay. So, you know, you just peel this back and then the wipes come out. Picked up the Halls cherry flavored uh, cough drops, and there are 14 in here. I picked up the Recula, Re, Re, Recula, Re, Recula, Recula, now I can't say that. They say the song, you know the guy with the big horn, Recula, well anyway, you know what I'm talking about. Maybe that, maybe that gave you guys a smile. So anyway, there's 10 drops in there. These tend to be expensive, but these are my favorite. If I have, you know you get that tickle in your throat and it's just kind of annoying. And the more you try and not cough, and the more you try and be quiet, like if you're in a library, you end up having a coughing fit. Well, these work great. And then the vitamin C cough drop, not cough drops, vitamin C supplement drops. I picked up five of these milks. I have talked about this before for your stockpile. You would have those. Okay, let's see. We did these. Let me think what I want to show you next. Okay, some practical stuff. Let me get these out of the way tissues. Allergy season, yes, I tell you all this all the time. I suffer from allergies all the time. They got worse. I never used to have them. The last four or five years, my body just decided this is the time. So I picked up two Scotty's brand, and they're 148 tissues. Then the next day when I went back, I thought, you know, I should just get them. 175 for the Dollar Tree brand. The Dollar Tree brand is perfectly fine. They're not rough or anything like that. So 148 versus 175, I'd go with the 175. A couple more times to blow your nose. Okay. What else did we get? Let me show you. Oh, let me show you this one. Here's another Christmas present here. So this is a makeup brush drying rack. It, it's pretty heavy. Um, I'm not going to take it out because it's for my daughter-in-law, but it says for drying, insert the brush handle into the supportive silicone holes upward and let the brush hang upside down to prevent moisture um, kind of, you know, just staying within the brush. It holds 14 brushes. It has, I don't know if you can see that, different size holes for different size brushes, but it doesn't feel like you know, a cheap dollar store thing. It's pretty hefty. It feels really good. Stocking stuffers. Okay. So let's see. Let me let me show you some Christmas ornaments. So this one is for me. Actually, these three are for me. I don't know what I'm going to do with them yet. I think I'm going to put them on a wreath. But this is Noel, and it's got the little holly on it and the berries, and it's plaid, red plaid. Then I picked this one up, and it says peace, and the same thing, a little pine cones, little holly, holly leaves, berries, and all that. Peace with the black and white, um, kind of a buffalo print check there. And then this one says joy with, um, so this one is more of a tartan, as you can see, tartan print. Can you see that on there okay, you getting that color? Okay. And then this one is the black and white, and then this one is the red and black. I picked these up and um, these are bendable. They have the wire in them. I don't want to touch them too much. There's glitter, the poinsettia, but they have the clip. So if you can see that there, you can clip that right onto a wreath or, you know, just different things. So I picked up two of those. And then I picked up a Christmas movie, Reindeer Family and Me. Um, I don't know what it's all about. It just looked like the northern lights are just the beginning in Lapland. So you have different pictures on there. 
Listen, for a dollar, we'll watch it. If we don't like it, it goes to Goodwill. But it looked like a nice, family-friendly movie. One dollar. They have this great new series of cookbooks. This one is called Cooking for Kids, Made Simple. Um, keto, chicken, breakfast, soup, pasta, vegetables, um, <clears throat> seafood, cookout, salad, cocktails. I'm not into that. Summer cooking. And this one is Cooking for Kids. So it's a dollar. It's a nice book. Look at this. Easy to read. Nice pictures. We're doing life skill training with our oldest son who has special needs. Cheap, basic, basic recipe and a nice, big, colorful picture for the kids to see. So if you're looking to do some cooking with your kids, it might be worth a dollar. Yes, you can go on Pinterest. Absolutely. But I like a book. That's me. Okay. Two things of yarn. They have the prettiest colors of yarn. They have like a mauvey pink and a, um, not a tan, a little bit more of a yellow. I don't know how to describe it. A nice fall, kind of yellowy tan. And one other color, I can't remember. They have five colors. This is called Jess Yarn by Premier, and it is 131 yards of yarn. So I picked up these clear plastic bags. They're 20 loop bags, and they're just clear plastic and they come with these silver little twist ties to put on them. And I also picked up these little gift tags. They're 30 by Jot Brand. They're just white with the ribbon. Of these for me, it just says give thanks. And they're probably like treat bags for Halloween. There are 30 in the pack. You can see those. Picked up these uh, 40 sealable bags. They have a Ziploc on the top and they're just clear. Um, I don't know what I'm going to use those for, but that's one of those things like sometimes you just, oh, I wish I had, so I'm going to put this in my craft stash. Here's what I was looking for. If you saw the DIY gift basket, I was looking for the shrink wrap where you can put a basket in it. It's a bag. You put the thing in it, and you can shrink wrap it. I couldn't find it anywhere. This is uh, resealable bags, and they are just in here. And they're probably about yay big. So, the last thing I'm going to show you real quick are a couple things I got at Dollar Zone. So this is Dollar Tree. So this was two days, this was two hauls, and this was too much stuff. But that's okay. These things, as you can see, some is for my mom, some is for Christmas, some are for gift packages, some are for stockpiles, some are for traveling. That's what it is. Okay, so Dollar Zone, Z-O-N-E. I know, I don't really like the color either. It was either this or <clears throat> like a baby blue. So it is what it is. But sometimes I'm doing, um, like I'm canning right now, and I have the canning lids, or I have um, Tupperware lids, that kind of stuff. And, you know, you want to air dry them, and it drives me crazy. I don't like them it's just laying all over the counter mm -hmm. so I thought this is just for a dollar perfect size to put them in there and then I can stash that away underneath the sink when I need to use that so again this is dollar zone okay remember I talked about I'm gonna do the eyelashes for my niece with the pink I'm looking for some maybe this this is solid here so check out these eyelashes can you see that on the backdrop of the white look at the colors rainbow eyelashes in that and somewhere in here is another one for my sister for her gift basket. I just picked up a mouthwash. We needed an extra mouthwash, just something practical. I picked these up <clears throat> also for work. These are the Bamboo Skewers, 12 inch. What else did I get? I got these. Oh, I'm, un I'm excited. Okay, they're art therapy cards and envelopes. A set of four for a dollar. And they're four, you really can't see them. You know what I'll do? I'll take a picture and I'll post it at the end of a close-up so you can see it because I know you can't see it now. But there are four cards and you color them in. How cool is that? So I have a DIY craft coming up. Uh, by the way, in November, if any of you are YouTubers, I'm going to start a collaboration and if you want to be part of it, you can just message me and I'll give you more information. I've been a collaboration now for September and October with other YouTubers. I'm inviting you to collab with me on DIY cheap and inexpensive Christmas and holiday gift ideas. So if you want to be part of that, I'm going to be doing that for the whole month of November once a week 
and I'll put you on my playlist, so just leave me a message and we'll connect. But I do a DIY, you have to wait and see, with cards, like a gift, and I thought one of these with each of those with some of the other cards, and again, I will take a close-up photo. I want you to see this. I thought for a dollar, envelopes and everything are included. It's fantastic. Okay, we're almost done. Oh, here's the other eyelashes. Can you just see me wearing these? Wouldn't they be cute? So that's what they look like with the color. I okay, on my bucket list for 2020, which I haven't even touched. Sounds crazy. We like to list new things we want to learn. New things we want to try. Not, you know, like I'm going to travel the world. I want to learn how to use chopsticks. I can't use chopsticks. I'm all thumbs. So they had these um, melanine, is that how you say it? Melanine? Melan melanine? Plastic. Um, chopsticks. A set of two. So I thought my husband and I were going to order, you don't know this yet, we're going to be ordering Chinese food in the next few weeks and we are going to watch a YouTube video on how to use chopsticks. We should probably video us trying to use chopsticks and get the rice up here and not land on here. Anyway, that was just something fun. I grabbed two more pot holders. This is going in a gift basket that I'm doing for someone. These are really, 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 really nice. I'm getting there. I promise, I promise. Okay. I have a problem. I keep losing my masks. We're still wearing masks here in New Jersey. I need a basic black for a lot of things I do at work. So I picked up a basic black. These are the best for one dollar. Let me show you. All right. It's all one piece of fabric. It's a stretchy kind of a, not a nylon-ish, but they're great. They have that little air vent. I don't even know what to use that for, but there you go. Over the ears, nice and simple, but they're breathable, they're comfortable. There you go, my basic black. Up another one, <clears throat> just to have at work. You know, I, I have to wear them all the time, so I picked up that. I thought that was just a nice fall color. I want to thank you again for coming by and visiting with me. Leave me a comment below and tell me what are your top three favorite things that you go to the Dollar Tree for. Do you always specifically go for these items or do you like to look around? What are your three favorite things you get at the Dollar Tree? Now I saved the best for last. I told you I'm gonna be, this is real, this is what you get. This is just Lynn. Now I must tell you, this is not my fault. When I went to the second Dollar Tree, we were there on Sunday, they had a big cart out front and they had pretzels, popcorn and cheese doodles on the cart with all around it was cotton candy. So as you walked in the door, you just had to pass by this. I resisted. I was good. Then I went in the store and in the front of every aisle, they had cotton candy hanging. I am a little kid at heart. I still believe in Santa Claus. I will confess. I really do. I believe in Santa Claus. I love going to the circus when it comes to town. I and I, when I'm at the circus, I have to get popcorn and I have to get my cotton candy. So this is my treat for me, cotton candy. So this will be my treat. So thanks for stopping by. Thanks for coming to my home. Hope you enjoyed the visit. Please come back and visit me again. Leave me a comment below. Please, please, please. I love your comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you can see next up and coming videos. And we will catch you next time on the next video.